Hello! Welcome to another episode of Rambling Nancy. Brought to you in part by nobody. Oh my goodness, what a day, what a day, what a day. The sun is shining, it's cool outside. A bit chilly. Shave my head. Not completely. Let's close that up. Just bust it all the way down. Why? Why not? Tell you, I hate anxiety. Mm -hmm. It is a piece of work. I've had it more or less, I mean, off and on for years, but since we moved up here, it's been a almost daily occurrence where my anxiety just goes crazy and I feel like I can't breathe. So that's healthy, right? were a person, I'd slap it in the face. No, I'm not that combative. I probably wouldn't. Probably wouldn't. I'd let it slap me in the face. Because I'm a pacifist. Not much into fighting. Every time I say I'm a pacifist, I think of Feel the Dreams. Kevin Costner's trying to kidnap James Earl Jones. I think James Earl Jones uh, comes at him with a bat. You're a pacifist. Shit. Pretty good flick. Pretty good flick, yeah. All time one of the better baseball movies out there. It's in my top three of baseball movies. I don't know what should be number one. Actually, no. Number one's probably Major League favorite. Uh, close second would be Fill the Dreams. And tied with Fill the Dreams is a league of their own. Probably fourth would be Bull Durham. Tim Robbins and Kevin Costner. Susan Sarandon's in that movie too, yeah. Tim Robbins for quite some time. Were they married? Or were they just dating? I don't know. Not anymore. I think they split up. Tim Robbins. Shawshank Redemption. Good show. Started watching it a little bit last night. Started reading the book. Well, the novella. Rita Hayworth and the Shawshank Redemption. Not bad. Not bad. Morgan Freeman. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was the first movie I watched that uh, got me introduced to Tim Robbins. And then I started recognizing him in other movies. Yeah, Anchorman, PBS, or Public Broadcasting News. <laughs> grows on all sides of the tree like every every bit of the tree branches north side south side so that whole you get lost you want to find north look at the moss on the trees nah -uh, not up here 
It grows everywhere. It grows everywhere. Yes, it does. mentioned it in my last episode I might be moving again I'm gonna try to get myself another job J-O-B <laughs> makes me think of Friday Craig the word of the day is job I want you to get up out get a job <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if that's word for word what he says that's a great show I like it I don't know about the other Friday movies. I, I, I didn't really like those very much, but the first one's pretty good. Pretty good. symptoms. No symptoms. So, yeah. Hopefully moving soon. I sure hope so. I really want to get out of here. Really want to get out. But hopefully I can get a job again back teaching. I miss teaching. Imparting my knowledge, my vast knowledge onto the students. <laughs> no, I have not a vast knowledge. Not a vast knowledge. little about a lot. And then a couple things I know a lot about. Jack of all trades, master of none. Jack of all trades, master of one or two. Boom. Roast it. I lay down with them, take a nap. They're three. One of them rolls over and starts patting my head. I like your haircut, Dad. You do? Yeah, it's soft. Oh, well, that's good. <laughs> Cute little poops. Yes, sir.
Yep, well, shoot, hey, there's some water. Been up here six months. That's enough for me. Get out as soon as I can. Hope y'all doing well. I can't see. And the exit I'm going to take is up here a little ways. And there, there's the exit. It's on the right. I'm going to take it up here. I'm going to turn right. There's a couple of roundabouts. And I'm coming on the freeway now. So I'm going to go. It's been good talking to you. Need to get back in the habit of rambling a little bit more off frequently, and um, I'll talk at you later.